Hey fat friends! Today I want to talk to you about a product that is sweeping the beauty blog world. I'm telling you it's everywhere right now so I had to have it. I had to go out and get it. It is from Cover Effects and it is called their Custom Enhancer Drops. So it looks like that. So this product is actually liquid pigment drops and I'm telling you the pigment is incredibly deep and incredibly vibrant. I've I've never actually seen a product like this. It kind of reminds me of like the Terminator when he's like rising up from the ashes and he's all like this glistening metallic color. It's like they captured this in the bottle. So I'm really excited about it. The color that I chose was Moonlight, um, but they have five colors. So Moonlight they describe on Sephora.com, which I don't know if I believe that description. They say it's a soft silvery glow, but I would say it's definitely more of like a rose gold glow. So Moonlight, I will show you a swatch in a minute. They also have Candlelight, which they describe as shimmery golden bronze, Celestial, which is glistening pearl, and I would say that sways the lightest of all of the colors. They have Sunlight, which is a soft golden glow, and then they have two bronzer colors. So those are their four illuminators, but their bronzers are Sunkissed, which is like a nice sunkissed look, and then they have Sunset, which is a deeper sunkissed look. So I would imagine those would be good for, you know, contouring and mixing with foundation to get a little bit of a darker look. So, dun dun! This is Moonlight. I'm gonna show you how it comes out like that tiny drop I'm telling you a tiny drop is all that you need this bottle it's not cheap it's $52 Canadian at Sephora but I justified it because honestly a little goes so very very far so you can see what it looks like here and I'm just gonna take my finger and run it down my hand I mean seriously look at that payoff look at it sparkle I know it's gorgeous so this type of product can be used three ways. You can put it on bare skin, like say if you're just like at the beach and you want a little bit of a lit from within look, you can put it on your bare skin. You can also use it as a mixing agent. So what I do is uh, mix it into my foundation a little, like a tiny, tiny little bit. Mix it into your foundation for that kind of lit within overall look. Um, you can also add it on top of your makeup. So that's what I did today. I put on my foundation, put on my bronzer and my blush, and then I added this on top of my cheekbones. So I put it on as I would in real life. You don't need a lot. It's very heavy handed, I'm telling you. It, it, could be, it could be a little bit dangerous if you put on too much. I'm telling you, you would look like, I don't know, a real life disco ball. So I put it on my cheekbones. You can see the glow. And what I'm gonna do is just like amplify that for you. Tapping it more. So in real life, this would probably look a little bit crazy, but for the camera, you can see where I'm going with this. I'm using the tiniest little amount, but I think it's super pretty. You can put it down your nose and see how it shines. It's kind of like a mirror. It's very pretty. Um, I also have it on top of my lips here. You can put it on top of your brows. And I just think it's gorgeous. It's a really cool product. Again, it's $52, so it's not cheap, but it will last a very, very, very long time. I will probably have this bottle until I'm 87 years old. Um, but again, it's Cover FX. It is their Custom Enhancer Drops. And I'm a fan. I think it's so beautiful. And I'll keep you posted on how it wears. I've only had it for a few days and I haven't really worn it out in like the hot heat. And I haven't tried it on like my bare face, but I have tried it mixed into foundation like it. And I have tried it over top of my makeup. And oh, and especially with powder makeup, usually these sort of illuminating products, if you put it on top of your powder, it kind of just like wrecks all of the job that you did before applying your blush powder. But with this, it really just sits on top of that. It doesn't kind of like erase it or make it all all smudgy like some liquid illuminators can do. So let me know your thoughts. I would love to see swatches. If you pick up any of the other colors, you can follow me on this, my social media feed for more new makeup releases. I have some new products coming up and you can always read our stories on imrfabulous.com. So thanks for watching. Talk soon. Bye.